<laughs> All right, guys, so this is probably gonna be a little long one. I got some graphs here, graphics. Yeah, it went all out, high end. Um, okay, really nothing to say. This is a story in my own version of things that motivated me to create Bitcoin. I'm really, what it really comes down to is I'm super excited. We actually had a real audit done. I'd love to share this with you. If you're interested, ask me for the PDF and I'll let you know what the PDF says about our audit. And we're currently doing a, a, a found a legitimate source of devs or hackers that have a, uh, that are like five or six of them are out to try and get a reward to crack the code. Just bang your head until you can get her done. You know, I knew I was in this space for a reason and it wasn't just to lose all my money. So anyways, this is my version of things and how this came to be in so far as how I think, see things as they operate. And there's some relevance to the timing of right now. And that's what I want to bring in first. In like 10 days, a woman who has the same name as my mother, Judy Shelton, she is going to be uh, like being confirmed as whether or not she becomes the next member of the Fed. And what's significant about her, supposedly, she believes in gold. Now, now, now so did, you know some of the past ones, but supposedly she believes in collateralized money. She believes that, you know, and, and what did I want to share again? The, 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 oh God, I had to drop it. I'm not going to edit this. Where the hell did it go? Are you kidding me? Oh. What the hell? There it is. This stuff right here, if gold gets monetized, this is called silver. This stuff here will just skyrocket in value. This is just uh, hand poured. It's all about the OG, right? Uh, so, and the reason she believes in this is because butt mother, butt fucking sucking 69 motherfuckers like this. This is Mr. Chippy, that, but that is Lloyd. Like, like, these are motherfuckers that are all about leverage and liquidity and volume. Those things that as long as they're happening, these guys become the richest guys in the world. Is that not clear to you? If it isn't, let's become a little bit more clear on how they're enabled and able to do this. Well, currently we've had this huge problem. I don't know what you want to blame it on. I think it's the masks because we're wearing masks now. We have this economic meltdown insofar as how businesses operate. But in order to keep things flowing in the perceived market of the, 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 these kind of guys create, I could put Zuck in here. I could put like Gates in here, not Gates. Well, Gates, he's Microsoft supposedly not now, but I could put a, a, a Bezos in there as well. And, and the reason I say that these guys are able to, that's the bankers and they do it off of liquidity. These uh, uh, other ones I just mentioned, they do it off of uh, uh, the keeping of the market up, you know, of the, 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 uh, the stock market. And how is that done? How is that done? Well, this motherfucking guy is our government secretary. He's the one who says, okay, we'll borrow the money from these motherfuckers, right? And so these motherfuckers represent you and me, and we're the tax dollars to these motherfuckers. And they say, okay, we're going to put these guys on the hook. And he says, okay, we'll pray that you pay us back. Okay, we'll fucking print up a bunch of money. But this, this perverted game of, of, of how government is constantly seeking more power and, and controlling the reason you wear a mask, uh, they've, they've gotten so bad at it that in order to keep the stock markets up, they hired this fucking fink. This lion two-faced fink. <laughs> See that? He's, he, he's, this, he's a virtue signaling projectile if there ever was the one who speaks to the idea that we need to have carbon credits for global warming. Uh, ultimately, this guy's BlackRock. He's the guy who's been buying up, like, fucking, uh, uh, cheap old fucking, um, what, mo a mobile home lot and fucking raising the rents on all those people there because it's just such a cash cow. And, and, and he now, this guy of BlackRock, asset managers, I guess his main thing, he is the go-between between this, I hope you pay me back, pay me back, motherfucker, and this motherfucker, who's with the state, right? Right? So all these guys have gotten together, 
And essentially what they've done is define fascism. Literally. This is the government, and this is the, the, uh, 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 the uh, uh, corporations, and they work as one with those that create and determine value. And now, supposedly, this woman's going to help us out. You know, maybe it's a good thing, maybe it's not, but supposedly it'll come us back to more serious money where guys like this, they don't fucking rape us because they're moving all the money through the volume, liquidity, and the fucking... Uh, uh, it's all a big scam. These guys all, they all share, share the same bed, you know? And I'm sure they all have their own way that they contribute significantly to humanity and make the world a better place as well. I'm not trying to deny that. But what I am trying to say is these guys are butt-raping your pensions. These guys are butt-raping every motherfucker. These guys are the reason we're wearing masks. And, and to believe any differently, because they're all working to, to help themselves. And if you can't see that, I can't help you. What I can do, for those that are actually listening to me, is like recommend you wrap your eye, mind around this Bitcoin thing I'm going to be coming out with. It's, it's, it's these guys that are fucking making money on the volume... It's not even their money they're moving. You're 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 using their f- fucking uh, intermediary services to move money around. And if these guys just got out of the fucking way, and 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 you and I decided to move money on our own, like fucking ledger, like fucking Ethereum, and we decided that, that, that when we wanted to hold the money, we just let it sit there. And because all the other people are using it to move the money, that comes back to us because it's all our fucking money. Does that make sense to you? I mean, if you're following Gandiji, you know, I doubt it. Because you're fucking following the lead to some dude who's got three years, 37 million, just an innumerable number of fucking crypto available to try and get the masses. It's stuck at 14, huh? Can they promote? Can they convince? Oh, it's funny. The whole space. I hope you're entertained by what I had to say today. I wish I was more mad, but my back's... I got the inversion table... Man, it's shifting things around. Anyways, hope you enjoyed that noise. Hey, new viewership, thanks. Uh, Sorry I'm not mad and angry. Just feeling pretty good, so (laughs) that'll change.